Yes, man. All right, people, welcome back to another reaction video. We're not waste the time. I'm reacting to something that I, I, I think is very interesting, you know, because things like them here, yeah, in, a, in, a, in a Jamaica, in Jamaica, right? You would have seen this and you think it's just, yo, a man are doing work. My chap on a tree and them something there. But in other countries, people look at these things and they turn it into sporting events. Now, I think this is called Timber Sports. And it's all about um, sport activities that they do with wood. So it includes chopping, um, sawing. And I think it's very interesting. Make we, make we go in. They start watching and they say, yo, hold on. I use this for a reaction video. So make we go in and see what it is. Athletes ready. Stand to your timber. Three, two, one, go. Hey. I cut out some of them bikes in there. You know, say as 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 you might see that and they have your yard and things say yo, that a easy thing, you know, you know, easy, you know. Yeah man, for you use a saw, pick up all of the woodwork brother them. Alright. But then car car pin that's up. Come on, I can say why? What kind of wood talk? Why? I don't know what I mean. No, no, no lunis, you see me? But big up all of the all of the carp into them, brother. And you see if you saw board and them thing there, you take a whole heap of energy. Whereas if, if you use like all a rusty saw, you can see if them saw brand new, fresh. Uh, but the size of the saw also comes into play because we know that the saw they no weigh and no little weight. And I guess they will try to beat a certain time to see who can like saw the fastest. Um we know we couldn't do that. It take whole heap of back muscle from them places, yeah. And your lats, you see me, because I work out now, so I know about it. Lats, your lats, it take whole heap of lats strength for saw and them things. If you move on a him one, yeah, man. I think them things are interesting. Your timber. Three, two, two one, one, go! Look like some chopping a go on there so now. What that? So hold well, on, them chopping have to put a board in it. Climb on the board and stand up. That means you have to trust your trap. So most of this look like it's a, it's a speed thing. Well, for the two we see so far, it look like it's a speed thing. That one I think said, this is very interesting. Because not only you have to chop, but you have to chop at the right angle and make sure you say the board where you have to wedge in it can wedge in there safely so that you don't drop off when you go up there. So you have to, you have to know what you have to do. You have to have some engineering intuition. And then you have to climb pony. A two, a two board wedge in you have to do and then you have to go up at the top now to chop down the bigger piece and all of this are speed thing them things are different but like we see them type of thing here because you know you can't really fly and go every country I mean as a man I'm afraid of flying so if you can go up on YouTube and see how other cultures operate I can do it So maybe I just had done. <laughs> I say I got my boss. Two, Two one, one, go. There's another one this. Hey, as simple as you see them thing here, you take technique, you know. If you notice what I do a while ago, after I'm done, make the slit and then wedge the board in it. He put the axe up at the top to kind of help himself up when he go up to the technique, people. 
As simple as you see it, you probably think, say, yo, we can do that. Technique, man. Technique, that, that bad still. <laughs> I'm a G, I struggle. Again, they are swinging axe. Them way there. They take only the power and strength for running. Two, one, go! Hold on, I want. Three, two, one, go. So that one let me know. Missy said them start out. Cause you have to have rules in here. A man can't just do anything. So them start out with them hand. Pan it. So that have to make sure you say yo. No extra time you know get there. So them start out with them hand and respond the lock. And then I guess it's a speed thing where you're supposed to cut three slices of the log um, the fastest and you see them now waste the time so them, them cut it down and when they come back up it's a cut again and then down instead of a cut come back up cut come back up cut so you just uh, uh, uh. fast movements <laughs> yeah them thing are different them thing are different I like it be pulled away from underneath him by this guy it's the Australian Lawrence O'Toole! Our final competitor tonight. This is it, ladies and gentlemen. So. Yeah, they fast. <laughs> okay, congratulations. The cut is good. Yeah, they fast. And I guess they might be assess the cuts on the um, logs. Oh, they have certain areas marked off where they have to cut. See, look at blue line them. They have certain areas marked off where they have to cut. Um, it's either a punit or within it. Ah, it look like I hate that people. Let me ask them, look at things here, I find them interesting because you would have there, yeah, they and just see some man cut down tree and cut lawn and them things and just think, say, yo, oh. you know, just something that, anything, but I guess from people willing to participate, they can turn almost anything into a sport. I just forget even the right sponsors behind me, but at the same time, all you need to do is just start. Just put the energy behind it, you can just start from like a community thing. And then people are going to see it, it are going to draw in tourists. Sponsors say, say, oh, people are coming to watch this. Yo, I want to put some money behind it. And that's how it become um, like some world championship type thing. Like how them have it on the level here. You know, this look like a people from different, different countries um, come to participate in uh, the whole um, timber sports thing. I think them things are interesting. Maybe in Jamaica we can have them, them type of something here too, at some point. Maybe it even not go on right now because you know, say, oh, they have like donkey race in our community. I think it's skater. I mean, they do a reaction video on time. And them think they can't get big, you know. I just feel like, you know, just continue to do it. Build up an audience feed. Get in sponsors. And you can bust off in a different way. But I, I think this was quite interesting. I, I hope you thought it was interesting too. Hit the like button, hit the share button, definitely subscribe. And um, I like can react to some more videos now. Uh, if you want to watch this video, the link will be in the description. As always, um, big up to the people who make this video. This whole reaction thing is weird in a guy. If you wonder if people are going to flag your video or copyright or all type of foolishness. So, yeah, that's why I'm going to try to react within the fair use type of thing. Um, yeah, this is getting too crazy. You think it, you believe it. And let me know what you think about this in the description. A description? Comment section. Alright, so you think it, you believe it. <laughs> and then you leave to achieve it. Oh, oh, oh.